motorsports provide many of us with many different experiences and emotions. For some, we're seeking adrenaline, and for others, maybe just a good escape with some camaraderie in the great outdoors. However, for some of us, it will lead to hobbies and even careers that can elevate you to heights you've only dreamt of. For Terry Bland, that's exactly what happened, thanks to a friendship with another racing legend, Bob Hanna. Bob Hanna is a world motocross champion. We come very, very close friends because we had a lot in common. Terry and Bob bonded over their passion for riding motorcycles. When he quit racing motorcycles, got into uh, selling aircraft. So I called Bob Hanna a couple of years after riding with him, and I says, hey, I'm interested in buying a second World War airplane. Bob told Terry that Dago Red was for sale. Dago Red was famously piloted by Frank Taylor to a national championship at the air races in 1982. There was just one problem. Well, I'm not interested in racing. Can we convert it back to a stock airplane? Once I started meeting all the racing people, everybody says, you can't put that back to a stock. You're nuts. You can't do it. That's one of the best airplanes out there at the Reno Air Races. They talked me into racing for a couple of years and then maybe thinking about it. I don't know if it's in the back of their mind they knew that I'd get caught up in it, but uh, anyway, that's what happened. We went to the races for a couple of years and we won the very first year we raced it. I think I'm the very first rookie owner of an aircraft to win the Reno Air Races. But Terry knew it would take more than just a fast plane to continue rolling with their success, Dago Red. Of course, it was all new to me and I never expected to win. Everything clicked that year and we did win and we started getting people noticing us so they were, we were able to pick who we wanted on the team and we got the best people. Bob Hanna and Bruce Lockwood. Bruce was the first pilot that I had in it. Dave Bogawaga, which was one of the main mechanics on the airplane, very knowledgeable. We had five A&I, A&T aircraft mechanics on the team. And as the team began to round out, Terry had another name of someone he thought would be a great contribution, Clay Liston. When he purchased the plane and I found out, I begged him to get involved because I was always an aviation nut, owned my own airplane, and I loved to work on anything mechanical. It didn't matter if it rolled on the ground or flew in the air. I'll come and work with us for a year, and let's see if everybody accepts you, then I'll take you on the team. So he did, and everybody fell in love with Clay like I did. We proceeded to go out to Reno Air Races and whoop everybody and become the grand national champions, fastest P-51 Mustang in the world. And after back-to-back -back national championships, the success just kept on coming. We knocked off five national championships in a row. When we broke the speed record at Reno for 512 miles an hour, first airplane to break the 500 mile an hour barrier, nobody could ever get past that point. Everything was perfect that year for us to do it, and we actually run the whole race at 507 miles an hour. And for their achievements with the aeronautical speed of Dago Red, Terry's second pilot, Skip Holm, was presented with the Thompson Trophy, which is awarded to those with outstanding achievements in aviation. And while Clay has some of the awards from the days of Dago Red on display at the Springville Tunix, the Thompson Trophy has a reserved home at the National Air and Space Museum in the Smithsonian. Our team, once we got all formed, didn't change a lot. There's a few came and go, but everybody pretty much stuck and become family. And even though we've been out of air racing for 20 years now, we're still family. Fantastic relationship. We would spend probably a good nine months out of the year preparing to race for just a few days. We had an amazing bond with everybody on the crew. And those bonds that turned friends into family turned mechanics and aviation enthusiasts into national champions. For At Your Leisure, along with the Dago Red Racing Team, I'm Will Oxley.